Hello guys, welcome back to SWS Boxing. Delighted to be joined with Alfie Clegg. He's now seven wins with one draw and two wins by knockout. And it's fight week. He's fighting Manny Mantezzi. Is that how you say his name? I ain't got a clue. I don't care. Getting knocked mm -hmm. out, boy. <laughs> uh, yes, and he's he's five and his opponent's five wins, one defeat. I mean, one draw, sorry. And um, he'll have one defeat by Friday. And he's fighting, the, he's fighting for the IBO Youth um, title. And yeah, good to get you back on. Thank you very much, Sam. Thanks for having me as always. And my first question is, how's camp? How did camp go? Been good. Obviously, we've had a we've had a long couple of camps, haven't we? Because obviously, after Adam Yaha, we uh, we trained for Adam Yaha to go straight into another camp. Um, so it's been like three camps all for for one fight. So it's been it's been a long few months to be fair, Sam. We've been um, back to back training, no real rest to be fair. It's just been uh, living the life of up and down the country. But we're looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to Friday night. Feeling strong, fit, um, just ready to go now. I'm ready to rumble. It's sort of three camps have rolled into one because you was meant to fight in December. Yeah, so I was meant to fight. I remember it was November. 25th, then it was December the 2nd, got pushed back a little bit, and then it went to, um, to obviously February now, so it's just it's just one of those things. Um, what can we do? You know what I mean? What can we do? It's just uh, boxing, it's just one of those things, and uh, like I said, it's, I'm, I'm looking forward to obviously to getting there Friday night, getting the job done, God willing, um, we go get the victory, and I'm looking forward to it. Why? Why would the fights cancel? Like on on in December, uh, was, November. So December, November, we pushed it. It got pushed back to December, um, due to some technical issues with the show and the venue. And then December, we obviously found out two days before. Um, it, it was having visa issues, so he couldn't actually get the flight over here. Um, but we flew him in. He's here now. He's in the country now, so he's in nice and early. Um, we just done our check weigh-ins today, and then Thursday we weigh in properly. So I'm looking forward to it. How did the the check weighing go? Perfect on weight, exactly on weight already. Um, so I weighed in at uh, fifty point nine. The cutoff weight's fifty point eight. So we're we're there. We're on point. Mm -hmm. Um. Yeah. So do you feel like this has been the best camp of your career so far? Yeah, like I said, it's been it's been a long camp. We've had a long camp. Um, it's been trying to manage it so I don't peak too early. Um, but yeah, it's been been a, been a great camp. Had lots of rounds. Had uh, some great sparring. Um, shout out to guys who have been sparring and know who they are. Been helping me loads. Um, but it's been 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 real good. Yeah, been real good. Mm -hmm. What do you know about your opponent? Uh, listen, we know he's he's busy. He works a lot. He gives a good go, and he he's strong. So he comes in. He comes in fire and everything. All guns blazing, and he's gonna he's gonna be super busy on the night. But. You can't hit what you can't see, so we're just making miss, let him get angry. We know he gets angry as well, we've seen it in his fights, so um we'll just let him let him do that, tire himself out and then and then go down there for the stoppage. Mm -hmm. Of course it's it's your first ten rounder. How how does it feel stepping up uh, to ten rounds for the first time? Yeah, I'm not too bothered. I'm 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 looking forward to it to be fair. Obviously I'm gonna have an eight rounder. I stopped him early. Um Done two sixes, so look, look, I'm ready. Like I've been sparring great rounds, um, and it's it's not a big step up for me. We're gonna we're gonna go do the business. Do you think it's your hardest fight to date? Yeah, yeah, hundred percent. He's uh, he's, he's listen. This is a, this is a this is a world title fight. <clears throat> you and you've got to be stupid if you think this is gonna be a walkover. The guy's gonna come give it his all. Um, this is an opportunity for me to change my life, and the same way it's for him to. To change his, so um, we've got to be on point. Can't take any any mistakes. Can't give up anything. I've got to be a hundred percent focused and locked in. And like I said, God willing, uh, will guide me to victory. Um, but I'm yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Mm -hmm. Um, is there any nerves going into this fight? Of course, you're you're topping the bill and fighting for your first belt. Do you put any pressure on yourself? Yeah, listen. Um, it's boxing. You got to be nervous. You got to be. You got to be worried. You got to have thoughts. Um, but I'm a hundred percent confident in my abilities to win. Um, a hundred percent confident that there's not going to be anyone that can stop me or beat me. Um, I'm strong. I'm fit. I'm naturally talented. And like I said, God's by my side. God's there with me. Um, 
And with that, all things are possible. Um, I've got a great mindset. I feel physically fit. I feel physically the best shape I've been. Best sparring I've ever had. Best rounds I've had. The most sparring I've had. The most rounds I've had. So I cannot be beaten. Um, and I know that for a fact. And like I said, Friday night, we're going to see an excellent performance. The A game, um, fully focused, locked in. And yeah, go get that victory. Been written in the books already. Um, and I'm just following the path to to go get the win. Mm-hmm. Um. Can we expect a knockout from you? Well, listen, like I said, uh, I've been working on a lot. I'm powerful. I feel super strong. Uh, I've been hitting hard. Been doing some great rounds, like I said. And this is going to probably be my best performance today. It's going to be my best performance ever. Um, I'm on my A game, like I said. I'm going to be slick, fast, doing my classy, doing the showboating. And then when he swings himself out, gets angry, time him, get him out of there, early night in the office, and uh, enjoy, enjoy sleeping in the belt later that night. Mm-hmm. What what does this belt mean to you? Uh, this is like I said. This is this is this is me. This is me changing changing my life. Like it's always been a dream to to fight for a belt. Um, and to and to win a belt. And so I've got a lot of people counting on me. I've got you guys counting on me. I've got my fans. I've got my my friends, my family, my sponsors. Um, and I've got the whole weight of my gym. Um, obviously the class great boxing gym. All the all the younger kids they look up to me. They look up to what I'm doing. And I'm fighting professionally, so go go get that win. Um, and yeah, like I said, Doug, we're all we've got all things are possible, and I know that. Um, just just with all you guys there supporting me, cheering me on, my mom, my dad, the fans, Angelica, all of you guys cheering me on. I'm just gonna I'm gonna be unstoppable. I cannot be beaten. No way. Mhm. Um. Does this like increase your world ranking? This fight? Yeah, I, 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 I'm I'm sure it, it should, I'm sure it should. It should it should shoot me up the rankings. Um. So it's a good fight. We both got even records. Both got no losses. So it's uh and it's an IBO Youth World Title fight. So yeah, once it's there, written on paper, I'll be classy clegged, uh, the IBO Youth World Title holder. And once I've won that belt on Friday night, um, it's it's just a stepping stone. I'm like, like I said, I, I love this. I love it. And just and just seeing it, picturing it, then raising my hand and the new Alfie classy clegg. It's just it's all coming to reality. And Friday night, that reality gets lived. Um, what would it, what does it mean to you? Everything, everything. It means everything. Um, and it's gonna be gonna be a great night of boxing. I'm gonna give it my all. Gonna perform for all you guys. Um, and it's uh, yes, yeah, the moment that we 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 changed my life. So I'm looking forward to it. What can we expect from you? You know what we're expecting. What we're we expecting, Sam. What are we gonna do? Outbox him, knock him out. Outbox him, class him, do the classy, rolling, slipping. Just box him, be smart. Obviously, enjoy enjoy it. That's the main thing. And then just, yeah, like you said, you said it already, knock him out. So I'm strong, I'm fit, I'm big for the weight. Um, and I just can't wait, Sam. It's gonna be it's gonna be an amazing night of boxing. Mm-hmm. Of course, um um he's he he's only done six rounds. And you've done, you've been, well, you were scheduled for eight, but you, you stopped the guy. Um, Do you feel like you've had enough learning fights? I mean, you had like, I would say, because maybe three sort of learning, maybe two learning fights or so. And then you've got to these tough fights because when you fought Anderson, I mean, you jumped up to featherweight. So you just. You that take- was a hard fight. And I say that to everyone that that guy was hitting hard. He was naturally, what, five, six, seven kilos heavier than me. By the time he rehydrated and that, he was definitely that much heavier than me. Um, And he was tough. He was game. And that right there turned me into a man. That was like, all right, this game, this boxing game's real. And I took his best shots. I took some amazing shots. I got knocked down. And nothing from that is going to be able to penetrate me. That, 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 was the, that was the hard work there. And since then, we've only got better, stronger. And now it's time to take what's mine. Yeah, because... I thought maybe if you fought that Yaha over 10 rounds, you nearly had him out of there. You Could you put him down yeah, twice? Yeah, I think we could have took him out. If we went eight rounds, we would have took him out of there. Um, but it's good to get the rounds in the bank and just and just get the rounds underneath me. That was the main thing of that night, is getting the rounds underneath me um, to make sure we can go on to to win this world title. Would Would you say that that was your best performance to date? Yeah, probably, probably. Like I looked good, didn't get hit with, with maybe two or three shots the whole fight. Um, he was southpaw, the same as my opponent that I'm fighting. Um, and I just I just made him look silly. Um, so that was good. I could have, like I said, I could have pushed on the stoppage and and maybe looked a bit scrappy, but I could have got the stoppage if I wanted to. But 
we looked good while doing it. And listen, this is boxing. It's, you don't want to, I don't want to be getting hit. Um, and that's the main thing. So if I can keep my, my face, keep it beautiful, then I'm happy. So we're happy. Mm -hmm. Do you feel like this is the, the fight to announce yourself onto like the, the big stage sort of thing? <laughs> Yeah, 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 this is it. This is it. This is where we start pushing now. So we win this. Um, these are my accolades at the end of the day. So we win this and then we go on um, and then start pushing to these TV platforms. So that's the that's that's, that's the next thing. But did you add um, an interview on Sky? Was it how long ago was that? That was just before the fight. Obviously, that must have been beginning of December, um, end of November time. Um, so yeah, we had that. We spoke to them. So like, we just got to come with our accolades. We got to win, um, and then hopefully over the next fight or two, you'll see me, see me on these bigger platforms. Um, you not, not hopefully you will, you will definitely after the performance I did Friday night. Um, I don't think I think you'd be stupid not to to get me to get me on these platforms. You know. Mhm. Mm and um, yeah. How many fights are you trying to have this year, roughly, or just full focus on Friday night? Full focus on Friday night for now. Uh, we take it after that. We we look to push on, and we'll be we'll be back out straight away. But um, Friday night's the main focus. Let's not look past that, and then let's just go get the win. God willing, get my hand raised, get that belt, jump up, scream. You know what I mean. I'm looking forward to it. I'm uh, I'm full of emotions right now, and I, I can't wait. Mm -hmm. And before I let you go, do you want to thank manager, trainers, sponsors, anybody who's helping you? On all your of them. All of them. I want to thank Dean. Um, he's put a lot of work behind the scenes to get this over the line. He still is right now. Xavier, Casey, Nick, Fisher, all of the trainers. Sam, um, I want to thank Sam uh, as well for coaching and helping me, taking a lot of pressure off me during my training. Um, he trains a lot of the classes and he, he takes a lot of stress off me when I'm in my fight camps and he's always there putting in effort. Um, and I like to thank everyone involved in my career supporting me. Come into my fight, share my post, you and your family, because you guys have been amazing, amazing to us. Um, and you guys are part of our family. Um, and I can't thank you guys enough. And then obviously all all my sponsors as well. So we've got five star roof care, Esprit Commercials, Magnolia Groundworks, Clean Cut Barbershop, uh, Hillside Lounge, Hungry Boys, Will Water Plastering, KB Jewelry, Alex's Calf, and Joe Bell Cleaning Services, and DNA uh, Blaster as well. So I cannot thank all them guys enough. Um, my mom and dad, I'd like to shout out. I'm stressful during camp. I'm uh, I'm I'm always I'm always stressed out. So they put up a lot of with a lot of stuff. And then Angelica, uh, my missus as well. She's been cooking for me, giving up nights for me, giving up everything for me, um, and I'm making sure that I'm I'm fully prepped for this fight, along with my mom and dad as well. They do that all the time. And dad drives me up and down the country to sparring over the last three, four months. He's sick of it, but it's good. It's very good. Mm -hmm. And from me, Alfie, thank you for your time and the new. And the new, champ. Let's go. I look forward to seeing you Friday, Sam. Thank you for giving up your time. You are the main man. Um, And keep smashing it, champ. You're doing amazing. Thank you, Alfie. Bye. Thank you, champ. Bye-bye.